Live from Exeter, it's ESN. Starring Austin Weatherman, Karina Karstens, Lulu Souza, Student of the Month, Cody Wilson, Haley Long, Angel Gibson, and your editor, Ben Madison. Good morning, Monarchs. I'm Austin Weatherman. And I'm Karina Carstens. Today is January 9th, 2015. Please stand up for the Pledge of Allegiance. Ready, begin. I, I pledge, pledge allegiance, allegiance to, to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Mrs. Allen wants to thank those students who donated toys to the Boys and Girls Club here in Exeter. Over 80 toys are donated. Drama Club will be presenting the play, The Crucible, this April. Auditions for roles will be January 26th to the 29th from 3 to 5 p.m. at the theater. Come prepared. Leadership would like to feature an amazing dance team at rallies and events. If you are interested, come to room 55 at lunch on Thursday, January 22nd. Yearbooks prices are now $75. Get them while you can. Exeter Wrestling announces this year's winner formal, Atlantis The Lost City. Ticket prices are $30 per couple and $15 for singles. Seniors, FAFSA is now open online. Go to www.fafsa.gov to apply. Are you interested in taking the ASVAP? It will be offered here at EOHS on January 27, 2015 at 9 o'clock a.m. See Mrs. Raina for more information. The first FFA meeting of the new year will be Tuesday, January 13th at 5 p.m. Extra Football Awards Banquet is Monday, January 19th at 7 p.m. in the cafeteria. Stop by Coach Franklin's for a flyer. Attention all softball players. We will have a team meeting on Monday, January 12th at 3.20 on the Varsity Softball Field. Every player planning to play should attend. Attention all baseball players. There will be a baseball meeting out on Lions Stadium Baseball Field on this Monday, January 12th at 3.30. You need to have your blue cards ready to go on that date. Attention all swimmers! There will be a mandatory meeting on Wednesday, January 14th at 12.45 p.m. on the pool deck. Golf meeting on Monday, January 12th in room 50 at 12.45. All interested persons, please attend. There's a track meeting next Tuesday, January 13th in room 53. Come find out what the school's largest team is all about. Plus, learn how to become an all-around athlete for all sports. Sign up by Friday and get a free lunch. <laughs> be there, be square. Now to Haley Long with the Student of the Month. Haley. What's up, guys? It's Haley Long here with your Student of the Month, Cody Wilson. So, Cody, what is your favorite thing about being a student here in Exeter? I'd have to say getting to wake up every morning and come hang out with my friends here at school. Are you very involved on campus? I do basketball, baseball, and football, and I was also involved in the school play. Speaking of that, how was it doing the fall play? It was very interesting getting to hang out with a lot of different personalities and people. Lastly, do you really play the banjo? No, I don't play the banjo. I do have one, but I do not play it. All right. There you have it, guys. Cody Wilson, your student of the month, who will be receiving this special gift card to TCBY. Back to you guys in the studio. Big shout out to Kirkman's VIP Pizza for our amazing shirts. And this week's winner for the VIP Pizza lunch special is Bola Destiny. Wow, she caught it. I did catch it. Victoria Painter! Victoria Painter! Yeah, Victoria! Please see Miss Reed to get your prize, which is this gift card! Woo! Yeah. And now to Lulu with sports. Hey guys, Lulu here with the sports. On Tuesday, boys Russian basketball played at Woodlake with a win of 46 to 17, and girls basketball also won at Woodlake with a win of 38 to 27. On Wednesday though, JV boys basketball played at home against Woodlake, the final score being 49 to 21. Wrestling beat Cesar Chavez 54 to 21 and Granite Hills 42 to 27 at Wednesday night's matchup. Now to Haley and Angel at the basketball games. Haley? Hey guys, it's Angel Gibson. And Haley Long. And we're here at the girls' varsity basketball games. Hey Haley, who's your favorite player? I'm gonna have to go with Lulu Susan. That's right, because she's making the other team. Well, uh, losers. Oh. We're at the beginning of the second quarter. Monarchs are up 19 to 6. Girls' varsity beat our rival Woodlake 65-29. Good job, ladies. Yes. Varsity boys and girls basketball also beat Woodlake the other night at home. Sports has been brought to you by Tikiaki. Buy any bowl and get any drink for free. Also, mention ESN and get a dollar off any sushi. This week's winner of the $10 gift certificate is... Bowl of Destiny. Bowl of Destiny. 
Benjamin Anderson. <laughs> Go to Miss Reed and claim your prize. Karina, back to you. Karina. Well, that brings an end to this broadcast. I'm Austin Weatherman. And I'm Karina Carstens. And as always, have a great day, Monarchs. Kobe! You totally missed that. They didn't need to know that. But they do now. Bye, guys. See you next week. <laughs> Come on, shout ahead them.